All right, well, this particular mural we're looking at now is called The Canoe. It was painted by, well, the mural was painted by me, but the original piece was done by Tom Thompson in 1914. Now, when we looked at some of the other paintings, you could really see that uh, experimentation that Tom was doing. He was really stretching for colors and, and looking for unique ways to paint. This is still early in his discovery of his painting career. So we don't have that crazy color going on. We don't have uh, those brush strokes that you can just see is meant to be a brush stroke. This painting is, is more realistic looking than most of, of the Thompson work that we know. Now that being said, he was an excellent draftsman. So when he did drawings of landscapes, they were accurate, accurate to the point that many people have gone into Algonquin Park and sought out the exact locations he painted just by looking at the landscape in the background. So this particular painting, The Canoe, again it's early in his career and you can see he's he's just starting to like the colors he's not exploring the colors but that brush stroke that that big bold movement of paint and these are things that he would have talked about with A.Y. Jackson when they shared studio space together A.Y. Jackson would have been telling him about the paintings he saw by Van Gogh and all the bold brush strokes and colors and such so you know here's Tom Thompson and all his friends they're talking about art they're thinking about art they're thinking about making new art and off he goes into Algonquin Park to, to try and come up with his own idea that that really represents what Canada is and wants to be. Mm -hmm. 